guys, <clears throat> Amy Love here, and I would love to be sharing with you the projects I was working on today. But uh, there's a kitty. <laughs> there's a kitty in the way. This is Jake, and he has a basket, mind you, right over here that he normally is laying on. But he was like, no, I'm going to lay right where you're working. So thanks a lot, Jake. But it's starting to get hot in here, so I need to make this video. <laughs> So let me show you what I did. I actually, um, I still haven't decided if I'm participating or not because I just don't have a lot of time right now, but in my friend Nicola's group, Facebook group, and I'll put a link to her Facebook group below, she's doing um, a swap. Oh, thank you, Jake. Let's move all the cat hair. For, um, for an altered glassine, a medium-sized glassine bag that's decorated um, in the Christmas theme and I'm like give me a reason to make something in the Christmas theme please <laughs> I'm so ready for Christmas crafting so I had these little polka dot glassine bags in my stash that a friend gifted me and I thought yes let's do that so I wanted to come on and then show you uh, what I created so I started with uh, two laces from Kim's store from Angel Dream Crafts Kim on Etsy and I'll put a link to that below uh, Jake is now in his basket giving me a dirty look because I made a move. But this is one of my favorite laces and it's just so pretty. So that's actually this top lace right here. And then underneath it in the back is this beautiful lace. So I uh, sewed them together and then I sewed on this uh, tree that I fussy cut out of... Um, what was that? It was one of the Stamperia Christmas pads. So I just, it was um, only half a tree, but I thought it would be cute on the side. So I cut it out and I sewed it um, onto the laces. And then I just glued the laces and the tree onto the bag. And then I decorated the tree with beautiful goodies from Angel Dream Crafts. I used some of her uh, rolled ribbon roses and uh, this is from one of the bridal trims. This is a bow from her shop. And then I stuck on some little pink rhinestones. And in this lace pocket is a, a little card from the Christmas paper pad. It's so cute. It's so cute. And I stickled it up a little bit. And that goes right here. I'm sorry I didn't clean this up. I didn't realize how much mess was really underneath Jake, but that's okay. And then I made just a little booklet to go uh, in this back pocket right here. And so this is a cutout from the paper pad. I put one of these beautiful enameled bow charms from Kim's shop on a bulb pin from her shop. And then I used seam binding, which uh, Kim does have white seam binding in the store to tie the paper in. And then I used that lace again to make pockets. And then it just has little uh, tags from the paper pad. And then I put joy on this side. And then this cute little stamp on that side. I just think it's so adorable. But it's like, really? I was like, can I just decorate a bag? No, it has to be totally interactive and have all the things. So I thought, Let's see if I can handle just, just decorating a bag, simple little shabby Christmas theme. So this was my attempt at that. <laughs> I used that really wide lace right there in the background, this guy, so pretty. Um, I didn't make it into a pocket this time. I just glued it down right on top of the paper. And then I used some of this uh, fantastic stuff that I got in my design team package. I am loving it so much. So I put just a little bit of that in the background. I was actually inspired to do that by Kim because I was crafting with her this morning and she was using it for something. And I was like, oh, yes, me too. I want to do that. <laughs> so thanks, Kim, for the inspiration. And then uh, this little peppermint. I don't even remember where I got those. I have some of them that I already just have cut out and inked and stickled in a bag from a couple Christmases ago. And so I got those out and then I uh, 
got this guy he's like on i don't know what you call that but you see how shiny it is it's not and he's a little warped in the middle because from the hot glue <laughs> and then i glued on the stamp right there and then i made a little shabby bow right here and um a cute flat back bling from kim shop but this is just nice and simple i just wanted to prove i can do it <laughs> because lately it's like the more pockets and tucks and things I can fit in there, the better. So these are my two Christmas in July glassine bags. <laughs> so I'd love it if you leave me a comment and let me know what you think. And I will have a link to Kim's shop where you can get these beautiful embellishments. I'll also put a link to Nicola's group if you want to get some shabby chic inspiration and uh, perhaps uh, participate in some great swaps. So I hope you're all doing well, and I'll see you on the next one. Bye, everybody.